did you ever ask you how a Bentley 4.5 blower would look like with a bow tail or what even is a bow tail? Well, stay tuned. Hello YouTubians and fellow hobbyists. Welcome, welcome on this Saturday morning. I hope you're all doing fine on this Saturday morning and you have maybe a nice project in front of you. Well, I finished just a project. It's my custom built Bentley 4.5 uh, blower. And uh, I always liked the Bentley, but I uh, thought the rear end is just like someone chopped off like a, you know, like you chop a piece of cheese or something. So, but I always liked like bow tails, like the old racing cars or those really elegant cars from the 30s, they look like a cigar or something, you know. I think they call it bow tail, but I call it bow tail. So, my plan was simple. I'm gonna chop off the chop off. <laughs> I chop off the chopped off. This nice sentence. Uh, rear end of the Bentley and will make a, a brand new bow tail. So, let's dive right, right in. If you don't know, this is a Bentley 4.5 liter blower, aka a supercharger. And this is his ugly rear end. The kit from Hella is a nice representation of the original. Some details are missing, but overall it looks like the car. The body comes in uh, separate pieces and needed to glue together. I mounted this a uh, styrene plate. Uh, at the spot where the new bow tail rear end should begin. Drawing the shape first on a piece of cardboard definitely uh, is a big help. The cardboard stencils then were transferred to styrene which end up in this sort of skeleton here. Now just a bit of meat in between the bones so to speak and voila you have a rough looking bow tail. A couple of hours of sanding and cutting and I was happy enough to make a vacuum copy from it. After some more detailing, uh, the vacuum form was painted and aged with the salting technique. Next step, taking care on the engine. The blower has two carburetors which needed to be modified a little bit. I simply cut out two styrene tubes to the right length and added them to the intake. It was just flat so it looked a little bit more like a real intake. This little hump should represent the spark plug. So I decided to scratch build some new ones. By the way the Bentley engine has dual spark plugs. So that means you have two spark plugs for each cylinder. So in some he has like eight for four cylinders. After some more detailing and painting, the engine was ready to marry the chassis. The brake discs were part of the aftermarket wheels. I drilled out the holes and painted them. The dashboard needed some detailing as well and that was pretty much all that I did to it. Now enjoy some pictures of the finished build.
All right, that was my adventure with the Bentley 4.5. A little fact at the end, Bentley actually just built the chassis with the motor in, with the engine in. So every customer had to uh, build his own body on it. So you might as well could say, I want to have a boat tail uh, Bentley, which I would definitely do because I just love that. But that's all for this episode. I hope you all doing really fine. Have a fantastic weekend. See you soon in the web. Such much more to say. Love you all. See you soon. Bye-bye.